Hey, real talk. <laughs> hey, that was quick, buddy. Welcome to the stream. How you doing, mate? It's been a while since I've uh, since I've spoken to you. Getting there, mate. Can I get in there? I've I've got one more level to go before I get to. I'm at level forty-five, so I've got one more level to go before I get to uh, October River. Oh, I can't do this here. I need to do it at the at the pond. Right, we're going to we're going here. Buy a license. And I think I've got everything. Let's check. I'm gonna use these two rods and then I'm gonna use this rod as well. Have I got everything I want? I think so. Pretty much sorted now. Yeah, I spoke to him about a month ago, and he, he didn't, he didn't really say anything or or anything like that. So I was like, right, okay, you know what I want to go for. So I, I don't know what he's what he's doing. It's a shame. It's, uh, I, I do miss the banter with them. It was it was good fun. Wait, I'm gonna buy some. I put some sweet corn on this one, and we've got sweet peas on the other one. <laughs> hey, Jacob. Welcome to the stream, buddy. It's always nice to see you guys. Yeah, you're right. Real talk. I hope he is okay, mate. I hope he is okay. I hope everything's well with him. I'm sure we'll see him back. I mean, he, he loves the stream, to be honest. Like like we all do, you know. So, hopefully we'll see him back soon. Hey, Classical. Welcome to the stream, buddy. Thanks for putting that in the, in the chat. Right, let's go fishing guys, I think we're all sort, let's just check, I'm going to use these two rods, it's the, the Mega Chubber 13 to Thunderspin 5500, Fluoro 22, Open Feeder 4.5 ounce, Mono Leader 16, 4 out hook, Sweet Peas on this fella and Sweet Corn on this fella, and the leaders are pretty much the same, 21 inches. 25 inches, so let's go. I think we're all set up and I've, let me just check my other rod, it's here, yep, yeah. for the sturgeon later on if we need it. So let's travel. Yes, I am, mate. 
I am. It's a Friday night, so yes, it's a real. On a Friday night, I am indeed having a few beers. Nothing, nothing crazy. Nothing crazy, mate. It's a, a quiet Friday night. Wife's in bed, so I've got to keep it quiet, she said. She says, I keep on waking her up when I'm streaming. And I says, well, I don't stream very often. She says, I but... When you do, sometimes you can make a hell of a noise. And I was like, right, okay. Hey, Heimdallar, welcome. And there's the richest man in Fishing Planet. Welcome, Heimdallar. Dollars, the, the Rockefeller fishing planet. Yeah, yeah, I could buy her earplugs, but she'd probably tell me to piss off, mate. <laughs> Which, to be honest, I would as well if. She I went too far. Come on, Cove, get your shit on. Here we go. No, we don't want this for right. I need to mix my chum, so I need to go here and go. It's all very technical this game now, to be honest. Well, when I say technical, it's... Yeah, I had I had a few days up at Alaska and made, made about 120k. God, that place is, is, is nuts, to be honest. It really is. Right, I think we're sorted. So if I go here and then go to jump... Same with this fella. I think it looks like we could be. If I select the correct rods, what were they? Six and seven. So that's six. Right. So we're chubbed up. So six has got the sweet peas on. There's been another update, so I hope the game's kind of fixed itself. Move on road number seven. Done, no, it's chummed up as well. Excellent. Day. Yeah, the last, last couple of days in Alaska, it's been uh, part of the cloudy day, so I've been having a Dolly Varden. The uh, Sockeye and the uh, Chinook. Here we go, ready? No, it's... Whoa, no, it's not what we want, we want. Oh no, it's six. Come on, Cove. Yeah, Alaska could be such a hit or a miss sometimes. I mean, as I said, I had three days up there, made a hundred and... Was that a hundred? A hundred and ten? hundred and ten K, and then I had another three days up there, and made like 40, so... It mostly avoided the, uh, the Chinook and just went for the, the Dolly Varden. The Sockeye and the Chum. 
on a partly cloudy day. A Shinook salmon can be can be difficult sometimes. They nuked that place about a year ago and it's never quite been the same. But here we go again. So I need one more. One more level to get to the Paktuba River in Russia. Which, uh, I don't know, I've got mixed feelings about that, to be honest. Because you, you can't keep the beluga. You know, I, I know that the beluga is a, a protected species and in real life, but come on, this is, this is not a real life game. It's just pixels, to be honest, you know? It's a bit of fun. So when you catch out the, the beluga in Russia, then you, you've got to let it go for some strange reason, which... Oh, no, 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 it's, it's, it's... I keep on pressing the wrong rod. No, I think I missed it. Oops. I got a member six and seven. Bees are still the favourite. Not as much on the sweet corn yet. So I thought I would split it just to see what the difference was. I put one sweet corn, one in peas. Yeah, I think that was kind of lucky. You must have been fishing Middle Earth, mate, to get the bull trout. And certainly get a unique one. Out. But, uh, I think the, the only unique bull trout I ever caught was on a was on a popper. But I seen uh, Sir Kill a lot. I don't know if you guys know him in the fishing world, but he's he's pretty knowledgeable. And he landed an 18 pound uh, bull trout tonight in Alaska. I was like, man, I'm on. I don't think anything is anywhere near that size. A unique, uh, a unique 18 pound bull trout. Yeah, fish by the rocks of Middle Earth, you'll get the the, the bull trout. I'm sure it's a sunny day to get it though. He's doing all the beeping. It's rod number one, it's beeping. Yeah, I've got one more level to get to, get to October. But as I said, disappointed with the beluga. You should be able to keep the fish. After all, it's just a game. You know, I like to play Hunter Call of the Wild and 
I would like to see an Africa map with a big five on it, you know, but I don't think it's going to happen because of the political stupid world that we live in, to be honest. And at the end of the day, it's only, it's only game where you have to be mad, you know? Anyway, that's my rant over for tonight. Back to the beer. So I just, I just thought I'd come back here and see if they've, if they've managed to... There's been a lot of updates, to be honest. So I just thought I would... Yeah, large minnows. Yeah, large minnows are good for the, uh, the bull trout. I think mine was caught in a popper or a crankbait for a minute. I'd need to have a look. So that's road number seven, yeah. I remember right this time. I was, I was fishing at Rocky Lake where I've got a couple of bottom rods. And oh man, it was just crazy. It's a nice trophy. I'll keep him. And he was on the sweet corn as well, right? Good, that's good to know. Now, I think they fixed the thing with the, the current. If your rod's in the, in the pod, the current doesn't take take it or move it, because that was, that's what used to be the problem here. Right, okay, okay, okay. The cart fishing's always slow here, right? It's I'm gonna say St. Cry, wow. And Joachim, jo Joachim, Joachim. I always fucking word, pardon me. I always uh, never pronounce it right here. We'll just say California. That's a nice, nice trophy. Decent XP, guys. Decent money. Right, 20 inches, right, that's good, that's good to know. Because I've, I've never uh, bait fished uh, Middle Earth. I've always used like a popper or a crank bait or a, or a bullet spinner there, so 20 inches. Good to know, buddy. Fish. Right, let's fish a little bit further out and let's see if if they fix this bug. We'll do a bit of testing as we go on. like it. I think that was rod number one. Pardon me. Right, 
right, okay. I think it's gone. I think I'll just go through the... Oh no, it's not. Oh, I can't put it out well. Oh, I've still got it. Oh, it must have all hooked itself. Nice. Yeah, I caught a, a nice big £50 carp last week as well. It was my biggest today, I think. Let's have a look. Just over fifty pounds. I was fair chuffed about that. Right, so I want to just move it, move this one over a little bit here. And if I go to rod number six. about here. I think that gives a good dispersion for the chum. I'm not really quite, to be honest, how the chum works yet. But with a bit of testing, I'm sure I'll, I'm sure I'll find out how it works. As I said, there's been a few updates, and I think they're slowly fixing the bugs out, but I think there's still a, a few bugs here or there, to, to be honest. But I'm, I'm sure that was to be expected, you know, in this game. I need to get a better understanding in because uh, here in Scotland we, we don't fish for, uh, use chum like this so I, I need to get a better under understanding on, on how the, the chum works kind of winging it at the moment to be honest is going with, with what I think 
whether it's a, it's a, a good or a bad choice, I'm not too sure. themselves don't really pay much or, or give you good XP but uh, it's still it's still quite fun fishing for them to be honest it's not a fish I fish for extensively but it's Yeah, it's nice time, Dalla, when you when you break some records. But the thing is, on the the PC version, is the uh, I think they update the records weekly. So I think you you're on the the leaderboard for six or seven days, and then they they go and change it. You know. Level up to 46 and then go to October River. Right, I thought I would, I would, uh, I would try that because I think I streamed this last. Is it New, New Year's Eve or, or the day after? I can't remember. It, it was before the latest patch anyway and, and you were hooking the fish and just before you brought them in they were jumping off. So I went and did the sturgeon. Because the sturgeon here as well are, are, are good money. They're not so great XP, but they're good money. Well, they're not bad XP. But they are certainly good money. I'm surprised. I'm on my kayak. I really had a good look around here. I think you could fish for the. Uh, what are we on? We're on a partly cloudy day. Up to nine o'clock. And then uh, again from. From seven to eight. 
there's not many people fishing here. I think it's just me and that guy over there. I don't see anybody else. But it's, it's a bit slower. Yeah, you're right, Hound Dollar. It's it's always good. It's always good. And I, I could probably no, it's probably been a week now. It's probably been a week now since I uh Oh well, maybe not. I could probably go and have a look. still be here. What was it, 50 points something? No, I'm not here anymore. It must have been over a week. It's nice to see your name in lights. can go away and get on a get on a boat and leave our rods. It looks like we're coming. I don't know what the different tones and the beeps are, or whether it's just a different, a different rod that's beeping. I'm glad I got rid of those bells. Mind you, the beeps are just as bad, to be honest.
quarter man, a part of the cloudy day, so 69. So we've got, we've got about half an hour yet before we Let's switch to the sturgeon. That's a new thing. Right, okay, okay. Press six. I just think I need to get this, this chum thing sorted out. No, it seems to be a bit slower than the than the last time I was here. Well, it was just a different day. To be honest, I'm not too sure. But it certainly slim slims seems a bit slower. <laughs> you say something in the chat that seems to go a bit slower then they both go off at once to be honest well oh. I wonder if we could rescue number seven seems like he's auto hooked I think Come on. Yeah, the dot hook. Wow. I think that's the first time it's done that for me. Oh, that's a nice trophy. We'll keep that. I 
I just thought I would for me try the difference between the, the peas and the corn. I don't think, to be honest, that there's all that much. Quite shallow water as well. It's only about seven feet of water. Expecting the, the size to be starting to ramp up now. Hopefully. Seems a, a bigger fish. Okay, 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 okay. We got one pair of hands. I don't think they're the same dollar, but yes, it is annoying. I'm like, right, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> I'm sure as the game evolves, I'll kind of sort these, these sort of things out, you know what I mean? Look at the bend on that rod, man. Jeez. Needs a fight. Yes, baby. 47.874 pounds. That's a beauty. Take a picture of her, that's for sure. No, no, wrong way. Press the east button. Picture taken. She's a nice one. I'll keep her. Then you come by, you come by that kind of fish. Well, not me anyway. Thanks very much, time doll. Much appreciated. Oh, 
That's the way. Tempo's picking up now. It's like it's come a lot more active now. Holy shit. It's a good way to level up guys, good way to make some cash as well. One on peas, one on sweet corn. Never know what you're gonna get. But coming nine o'clock, I'm gonna go and do the. Uh... No, what am I gonna do? Gotta do something. Gotta do the sturgeon, that's what it was. We'll do the sturgeon just to fill out our bag. And then we'll, we'll call it a day. It's good, I'm glad we've sorted that bug out. It look, looks like it's sorted that, you know, when you when you fight the fish and bring it in, it, it, it used to fall off the end of your line, you know, you're like, well, whoa, what's the deal here? But it looks like they fixed that bug, which is excellent news. I've never seen that. That was like out of the corner of my eye. Normally it would be beeping and all sorts. Well, that's a nice fish. I mean, to be honest, I don't even know if I'm, I'm fishing with the, the right chum and, and, and mix and stuff. They're both be. I, I think, I think they beat with each other in in, in s s sympathy. To be honest, it's like, uh, oh well, I'm beeping. Oh well, I'll have a beep. All right, I'm not beeping anymore. All right, I'm I'm not beeping either. But if you beep, I'll beep, and it's like, right, okay, but it's like, oh wait a minute, 
I'm gonna have a break because I don't I don't like beeping all the time. And the other one's like, right, okay. But if you beep out, see? Another one's saying, well, I beeped twice and you didn't beep. What? You did, see, look. So you beeped twice back and now they're beeping to each other. I tell you, it's, it's so funny. <laughs> or it's maybe just me. Maybe I had too many beers. It's a love story, I think, between the beeps. It's like, will you beep me? Nah. Only if you beep again. Right, okay, I'll beep again, then I'll beep you back. Maybe I'm speaking a lot of shit now. Sorry, guys. Sorry, concentrate on efficient. Right, okay. I know these fellas like to, to nibble a lot. Uh, I know the common carper are well known for nibblings. Decent money, you know what I mean? It's it's quite a good money making maker here. It's fun though. Yeah, I don't think there's a lot of people. for all right okay put away again all right i got you I got you bud is he a fatty come on give us another fatty but I don't think this is a uni fish. It'd be a decent trophy though. Yeah, two hundred pound trophy. Decent enough. Yeah, yeah, we'll get you in a minute. Feeder fishing here, it's good fun. It really is good fun, guys. You should come here, do, do some feeder fishing. I mean, it's it's not the blessed, the blessed, Jesus, go on, go speak right. It's not the best place to rank up, but I think between this and Alaska. A ranking is probably in St. Cry, maybe. St. Cry. <laughs> There's a lot of good guys there as well. But I've not done feeder fishing in St. Cry, and that'll be tomorrow night, guys. I'm going to give that a go. I'll do it blind, I'll not test it. Woohoo! So I'm gonna try for the pike and the musky. I 
All right, okay, I'm behind Allah. You got more CR carp. Big times on corn. I'm just, as I said, I'm just, I'm, I'm, to be honest, guys, I'm just kind of fooling around tonight. I'm just kind of messing about. Just thought, you know what I mean? I was, I was, I was ranking up and concentrating on my fishing, 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 fishing. And got to level 45 and, and when I got there and I thought, you know what? Like, stop all the serious stuff. Let's just do some malarkey. And let's play a bit of Fishing Planet and I'll stream it. You know, it'll just be... Just be a bit of fun, to be honest, rather than, you know, being kind of type of serious about it. Hey, Classical. Thanks for putting that in, buddy. Keep up the good work, mate. That's why you're a mod. Love the work you do, mate. Much appreciated, Classical. So yeah, I might do some St. Croix tomorrow. St. Croix? Am I, am I talking about the right place? Yeah, Michigan. For the, the Northern Pike and the Muskie. I might do some bottom fishing for them fellas. I've not tried to do that yet, so... That could be good fun. I've not tried to bottom fish yet with live bait, so no, I'm not. I'm not too sure if I could, if you can. I'm sure you can. I'm sure you can. Yeah, we've got about five minutes or so on these fellas, and then we'll go to the sturgeon. I'm sure I'll fill my net up. And then if, once I fill my net up, we'll call it a day, guys. in the chat go check classical gamer uh, he's got some good content out there he's got good some some good stuff go check him out and show him some love I love the bend on these uh, feeder rods It reminds me of the old days when I was salmon fishing. Oh, I used to love salmon fishing. There's a lot of nice salmon fishing here in Scotland. 
it's a be- it's a beautiful place to go fishing. You, you so spoiled for salmon and and trout and pike and perch and roach. There's a lot of decent fishing here, guys. A lot of good fishing. Some of it can be very, very expensive, and then some of it can be very, very not expensive and, and still yield the same results. Honestly, we'll, we'll go finish off the night with uh, catching some white sturgeon. They're good cash, but the XP's not, it's not what you expect from, from a sturgeon. But the cash is, the cash is good from them, guys. Well, for a, for a couple of trips, let's, let's have a look. Let's have a look at our net. Let's have a look at what the damage we've done so far. So we've had it, one unique, yep. Which is a, a decent beastie. Trophy, 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 trophy. And then the rest, commons. But if you look, we've, we've done 20 grand just about, 21 fish, XP wise, oh, I don't know, I don't know where the XP wise, pardon me. But we've done all bad and we're not finished yet. Oh no baby, we're not finished yet. Okay buddy, you take care. Thanks for... <laughs> Thanks for what you do, Classical. You take care mate. Thanks for you always.
So who's beeping? Somebody's beeping. So are they, are they both beeping or is it rod number one that's beeping? So rod number two is having a meltdown then. And it's a white cutfish, I think. Is that a white cuttlefish? Oh no, it's a... It's a trophy bluegill, wow. Okay. Trophy bluegill like sweet corn. That says something to me, it's time to move on. <laughs> well, Heimdallar, I, I'm on my third mate, so cheers to you buddy, you're one ahead of me. Slange as they say in uh, whatever land they say, Slange in. Is that Norway? I worked in the Shetlands, that was the closest I got to Norway to be honest. I did land in Stavanger once. When uh, I came off a platform in the, in the North Sea and uh, Aberdeen was misted out. And the helicopter pilot says, well, we've got to go to Norway. And so, uh, yeah. It was only once though. Had a few beers tonight, mate. Had a few, but yeah, I'm not into serious. Yeah, I know what a classical gamer. You take care, man. You're a good buddy. Sorry, I've just got something to chop. Right, we need to get these uh, rods in because we're... No, maybe. We need to go fish for a new fish in a new location. We'll fill our bag up and then we'll go to sleep. It sounds like Santa, to be honest. Right, let's get these guys in. Let's get this in. Right, okay, what a chum up. Whatever. Put it away. Let's get this in. No, that's not what I was expecting. That one then. Okay, I've got some more, right? Put that one away. 
Right, put that away. Right. Got to put this file up. And then we've got to go. Right, let's have a look at the town. Right, we're on day one, so we want somewhere around about 11 p.m. Yeah, we've got license. Get the fuck, get the fuck out of here, license. I wanna go here. Five is it? No, is it number four? It's a guess a game now. Oh, it could be, it could be, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, I'm all right. I I like to have a, a few beers before a stream. To be honest, it always kind of relaxes me. Any about a chat, if it, you know what I mean. If if anybody wants to engage me in in chat and stuff, but we'll fill our bag up here quite quite soon. I'm sure. I know a fish for these fellas. We had fun with the carp. The carp was good fun. And then just to finish the bog off before I go to bed, to be honest. Not as honey as fatty. I mean, XP's get a lot more XP elsewhere, but the cash, cash, the cash is good. So we did this bit, we did this post here, and I'm going to do this other post just, just about here. You can see they're interested. I want a bit of a nibble. You can tell because we're, we're, we're fishing quite shallow and these are big fish. Still there nibbling away. It is like I'm wanting some of that, man. There we go. It's so too easy.
And look at the, the cost. I mean, 20k. XP. Well, so so. But the cost is. Oh, it's good money. It really is good money. So let's have a look up here. The, the spawn socks need to to, uh, to call that fancy to be honest. They're never letting all that that far away. But we're close to filling it out, which is which is a good thing and, and XP and you know level forty six soon guys. I'll be fishing in Russia. There's a lot of big fish out here as well. Yeah, that's, that's a decent fish. Look at the cost, guys. That's, that's an outrage. Right, where are we? Over there. So let's try this fella. We're just about maxed up in our net. A couple more. You're aiming. Where are my markers? Yeah, I know, I know, I know where to catch a fish here, bud. Thanks, Heimdaller. Yeah, I know where to catch a fish here. I've said before I just kind of alternate between these two spots and it seems to work for whatever reason obviously the, the, the gods of fish and planet have said right okay if you, if you alternate between these two spots oh, that's a nice fish look at gosh the gosh it's great XP, yeah, yeah, not that great, but the cost is good. Good mind thinks alike, especially speaking to the Rockefeller of uh, <laughs> of Fishing Planet, mate. Four million or six million, whatever you've got, Jesus. I don't know if you know who Rockefeller was, but he was the 
the, the tycoon of uh, oil and well, back in the day, back in the 40s. And everybody was frightened of him, that's why. Well. That's how you got that name. Well, not why you got that name, but that's why. People use it today, say Rockefeller, I'll come get you. No, oh, see, here we go. <laughs> here we go. I love this game. I really do love this game. <sighs> hey, it's a little fella. Come on, little fella. Yeah. What do we do? What do we do? I think we call it a day, guys. Let's let's have a look how far we're off. Get into October. So we've got we've got fifty two five seven eight and we need fifty eight one eighty eight five. So we, we've we've got a bit to go then, Pete. We've got a bit to go. I tell you, that people almost four point one million now. I like to make money and spend it, man. As I said, Heimdall, you're the Rockefeller uh, uh, fishing planet, man. You've got the monopoly. You've got the money. You spend it, man. Take care, guys. It's a pleasure, as always. Leave a like if you like what you see. Hit the subscribe button. It always helps me. Take care, guys. See you in the next stream.